Hello, my name is Heidi Wittenberg, and I'm here to talk to you about vaginal depth. Now, um, a lot of times in consults or people ask, um, what is the depth of a um, needle vagina? What is a depth of a vaginoplasty trans feminine procedure um, that we can expect? So a needle vagina is nine centimeters in depth and um, we try to compensate for the la loss of elasticity with the skin grafting technique by adding a couple more centimeters so 13 centimeters is the usual standard if you're going deeper than 13 centimeters on, on occasion um, we've been able to obtain a couple more centimeters but really past 15 centimeters you're more at risk of entering the peritoneal cavity, which may sound like a great idea because of discussions of the peritoneal pull-through technique, but it actually isn't. Um, because if you're having skin graft as your vaginal lining, entering the peritoneal cavity actually exposes the vaginal lining to the fluid that the abdomen uh, makes, and it'll actually push against your graft and increase the risk of failure uh, of the graft taking. So uh, bigger isn't necessarily better, and uh, nine centimeters is actually the natal depth, and so 13 centimeters is very reasonable. So optimally, we try to get 13 centimeters. Postoperatively, patients tend to lose half to a full centimeters per, because of natural healing. Um, there are occasions intraoperatively due to scarring or issues that we've gotten a range of um, nine centimeters to again like 15 centimeters um, would be the deepest um, that you could um, safely get. The deeper the um, vagina also the higher the risk of getting into the rectum um, so that also increases your risk. There are patients who ask for minimal depth um, and that is really up to uh, individual uh, desires of what your goals are. Um, I'm going to say that the prostate or the G-spot is anywhere about four to five centimeters in and that might be a nice depth for a minimal depth if you want um, that is an option. Um, with penile preservation techniques, it also uh, does come up as far as what is your desire for depth because if we're doing skin grafting, um, there's going to be less skin available for depth versus discussion of grafting from other areas like the peritoneum. So that is a nutshell discussion of vaginal depth and in comparison to natal depth of nine centimeters. Thank you.